a really good way to show that quicksort is better than selection sort, particularly as the number of things that you're sorting increases, is to draw a graph. And that's an easy thing to do in, say, Google Sheets or in Excel. So this is the format that you would need to have your spreadsheet in in order to do that. Uh, so the first column here would be, in your case, the number of things that you're sorting. And you'll see in my case, it goes up nice and evenly, 10, 20, 30, 40. It doesn't go up in big jumps. So my graph is going to be nice and smooth. And then the two columns of data that I'm comparing. So this would be perhaps the out, well, this would be the output from the program, the Python program that you've uh, been using. So to draw the chart, I'm just going to highlight everything so highlight from top to bottom and insert chart and it's pretty much done for you there you go so now it's uh, an opportunity for you to talk about the shape of these graphs and say how they are increasing and how for, you, you'll be able to talk about how quicksort obviously is getting way better as um, you get to more things that you're sorting um, over here, of course, to help the, communicate your idea, you might want to change things like the chart and axis titles, um, uh, probably not too much else. Just make sure you're really happy that it communicates your, um, your understanding clearly. That's all you need to do.